Hi, my name is Poppy. I'm a trainer with MakerBot Learning. Let's take a look at MakerBot's PLA filament. PLA stands for polylactic acid. Originally developed as a bioplastic, PLA is derived from plant starches found in potatoes, corn, and soy, for example. It is a new plastic to 3D printing, having only been used for the last few years. PLA works for a wide range of 3D printing applications because it's so easy to use. At MakerBot, PLA comes in three different varieties, True Color, Limited, and Specialty. The latter includes translucent colors. To 3D print PLA on a MakerBot replicator printer, the extruder heats up, melts the filament, and layers it on the build plate. During this process, a fan in our smart extruder rapidly cools the PLA as it prints. PLA smells like syrup while printing, and additional ventilation is not required. Because PLA likes to be cooled rapidly, you can 3D print bridges up to two inches long and vertical overhangs up to 68 degrees without needing supports. When 3D printing in PLA, you should make sure your build plate is level, and we recommend using a raft. Once your 3D print is done, it's ready to be taken off the build plate. Post-production is easy. You will need to remove supports and rafts using a set of tools. For a more refined look, acrylic paint can be used on PLA. You can also use PLA in mold making and casting techniques. If you won't be 3D printing for a while, make sure to unload and bag your spool of PLA. This filament will absorb moisture from the air and could swell in humid environments. Unwanted PLA prints should be discarded in the trash or sent to a number seven recycling program. PLA also breaks down in a landfill or an industrial compost. On behalf of MakerBot Learning, thanks for watching.